Hello guys, today we are going to be learning about regrouping. Okay, let's see what regrouping is. Regrouping. How do you multiply more complicated two-digit numbers? Regrouping or decomposing is similar to clustering. It requires rewriting both multipliers. Okay, let's break it down. So, 27 times 64. Okay, so we know that 20 plus 7 equals 27, right? Now, 60 plus 4 is 64. Now, we can do this to have a simpler process so that we can multiply these hard numbers. Okay, so 20 times 60. Let's see what 20 times 60 is. Now... We are going to just take our, we are just going to take our 12 and then we are going to put our zeros, we're going to count the zeros and add the zeros. Now, you have 12, I mean, you have 1,200. Now, let's see, 20 times 4, what's the answer? 80, correct. 60 wow. times 7 equals, let's see, 60 times 7. We're going to take our 42 and add the 0. Easy. Now, 7 times 4 equals 28. Now, we're going to add our digits. Now, since we have three zeros, there's nothing for 8 to be added into. Now, you're going to have to take your 0, then 8, then 2, then another two that adds up to 12 now let's put the one over here for a carryover now one plus two that's three plus four that's seven and bring down the one and the answer is 100 i mean 1728 now that's our answer now this is called regrouping and right here i'll re i'll write it regrouping now, this is the topic we're going to be focusing on. Now, we are going to explain it. Now, regrouping or decomposing is similar to clustering. I mean, clustering. It requires rewriting both multipliers. Both, mo both numbers need to be broken down into smaller parts. So, so since I showed you what regrouping is, I'm, I'm going to erase it. So, let me erase and then I'll show you another math question. I'm going to give you one. 38 times 79. Let's see. So, 38 is equal to 30 plus 8 equals 38. And so, comes with 70 and 9 equals 79. Let's break it down yet again. 30 times 70. Now, we're going to take 2, 1, 0, 0. What's the answer? 2,100. Let's see what is 30 times 9 equals 270. I, I just gave you time to think of the answer. And if you guessed 270, that was correct. Now, let's see. 70 times 8 equals 50, 560. So, we are going to come up with the final number right here. 8 times 9 equals 72. Now we're going to add. So there are no thing there is no things to add to 2, so we'll just bring it down. Now 0 plus 7 7 plus 6 13 plus 7 equals 20. Now we have a carry carryover of 2. Now that will be 2 plus 1 that is 2 plus plus like 2 plus 1, that is 3. 
2 plus, I mean, 3 plus 2, that is 5, plus 5 is 10. Now, we're going to put it over, and then we're going to add 1 plus 2 equals 3. Now, the answer is 3,002. 3, that is also regrouping. So, the answer is 3,002. 3, so, that is our lesson for today. Thank you for watching and I'll see you again next time.